hey welcome back to beauty by bordeaux today i will be doing a full set which means i will be showing you the process of me doing my nails on both hands my dominant hand and on my non-dominant hand so what i'm starting off with now is my peel off base coat which is just putting a layer of cuticle oil on the nail and then covering it with a layer of top coat and curing it for 60 seconds underneath my lamp and what this does is that it makes it easy for the nails to literally just like pop off like i think i soaked them for about like maybe 10 minutes or so and then once they you know i soak it and then i just pop the nails off using a cuticle pusher and it's been really really good for me and it helps me to make more nails create more nails because i really like poly gel and poly gel is terrible to get off like i hate trying to take off poly gel sometimes it will take me just as long to take it off as it did for me to do the nails so that's why i do the peel off base coat method and i'm pretty sure i heard about this type of peel off from nails by vic Alrighty, so now I'm just curing my peel off base coat. Got my cup of water and my blunt. This video was taken on April 23rd, and today it is June 20, July 28th. So, yeah, this video has been in my camera for a while, and it took me forever to edit it because editing nail videos are so much more complicated than trying to edit beauty or makeup videos because my makeup videos usually take me no more than an hour like the total filming length is an hour but with my nail videos sometimes they could be up to four or five hours long and it's not one five hour long video i'm editing it's multiple maybe one two hour videos so it gets really difficult um and that's why you know i don't <laughs> edit my nail videos as fast because they just sit in my phone until I'm ready to edit them alrighty but you just saw me put on these little short stiletto nails and I used the KDS glue um, so first what I did is I, I set them out you know all 10 nails I then used that little uh, cone shaped drill bit to sketch the insides of the nail I glued it on with the KDS nail glue and now what I'm doing is just smoothing it out um, and buffing the edges and the top of the nail to make it you know get rid of that shine and what I'm doing with the nail file the nail drill right now is that I'm going across each one of the connecting points so like the edge points and I'm smoothing it so it looks more seamless with my nails and it just doesn't look like a big like thing sticking out because sometimes when you don't do it you can see it through your poly gel your nail polish builder gel whatever you're using you can see it and the only way you can really not see it is if you build it up really heavy so after i go and i thin those uh, thin the edges out i then just take a buffer and i'll just buff all 10 nails brush off the dust and now i am ready nope I guess I'm not ready. I must have had to do some more filing. Um, because those had those little circles and I probably had to go through each one of them and just like, you know, file it. Um Alrighty, so now I'm just filling up my glass straw with some alcohol. I might have done a little ASMR, but it probably didn't come out that well, which is why it's all it's not in the video. So once I fill up my little jar with the acid um not the acetone the alcohol, I will go through each one of my nails and I'll just clean the dust off of my nails, showing you what it looks like. Now I use the Mia Secret dehydrator and the primer to put on my actual nail. And once I do that, let it dry, then I'm going to put on a layer of base coat on all 10 of my nails. And what you see here is that I did my thumbs first because I knew I was going to be wearing these for the week. So I wanted to make sure that my thumbs were good, um, that they were fully dried and cured. So now I'm just doing the other four fingers on one hand and then I'll do the other four fingers on the other hand. Thank you. 
Okay, so now I'm starting off with the McCart Poly Gel in the color Le Crepe. And I am going to start off with one hand. I believe this is my me doing my dominant hand. So the brush must be in my left hand and this must be my right hand because I am left handed and it's easier for me to do my right hand than my left hand, which is why my right hand will usually be done perfect and my left hand be looking kind of janky. <laughs> janky. I'm sorry. That's just like such an old school word. But anyway, um, like I said, this video was filmed on April 23rd so my shots are not good but I have been working on my angles and my shots and making sure that you guys are able to see everything um, and then it would also cut out some of my editing time but I think the hardest part with editing nails is like for me I want to see everything I want to see every step every process but there's so much filler so much in between and I feel like a lot of YouTube, well, I feel like a lot of nail videos on YouTube are on the shorter length, anywhere between like 10 and 20 minutes. And I'm like, how do you squeeze three, four hours of a video into like 10 or 20 minutes? Like, that's crazy. So that's been my hardest part is trying to make it short and not too long, but not so also speed it up so much that you can't really see what I'm doing. But yeah, so now I'm going on with my second poly gel, which is the Muravan 188. And that Muravan is a temperature change. So it goes from like a red to like a light pink. So I am just going to start off with doing one layer of poly gel over my nails. And you are going to see me mix the poly gel with the Le Crepe poly gel, the 188 poly gel, and this white McCart poly gel. I will be doing a marble on some of my nails. Um, I don't think there's anything more that I need to say. So yeah, you can just go ahead and watch me do my nails. And like I said, I will, I should be putting in um, the second part for my non-dominant hand so that you can also see that.
Okay, so I have put on all my gems, my charms, finished up my nails, did the top coat. I just put on some honeysuckle cuticle oil, and this is the finished product. These nails took me a long time to do, but let me tell you, these nails was absolutely adorable. 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 I love them. I still have them. I lovely, lovely, lovely nails. They were like oh, just perfection. Alrighty, I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.